Hello, welcome to uh, DuckDB for Geospatial. Uh, in this new uh, video tutorial series, uh, I'm going to teach you how to use uh, the DuckDB database to store and uh, analyze geospatial data uh, efficiently. So this is one of the course that I'm teaching at the University of Tennessee uh, this semester. And so it's called uh, Spatial Data Management, uh, Geography 414. So this course has two uh, components. The first one, um, teach using cloud computing, Google Search Engine, and the second uh, part is teaching uh, spatial database. I used to teach PostGIS, and I recently discovered the DuckDB. I've only been using it for the past couple of days, and I really like it. And so now I'm going to switch to teach actually DuckDB first. Um, and if you're interested in learning about this, you're welcome to follow this course website and also video tutorials. Um, so we are teaching this. Uh, starting tomorrow, October 23rd, uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So we have three uh, lectures per week. And if you're interested in, uh, follow the video. I will teach this in class, in person, but I will also make the videos available on YouTube so anyone can watch it. Uh, you can check out this website for all the updates. Uh, so this is what we're going to cover uh, tomorrow. I just want to record this brief video, um, introduce what is coming. And so if you're interested, definitely follow up. Also, all the videos uh, for this course are also available on YouTube. Uh, so right now we have 24 videos. Uh, these are all using Google Engine, Python, and also GMAT. And so all the following up uh, videos about DuckDB uh, will also be here. I will also create a separate playlist uh, if you just want to do uh, DuckDB. And this is a new database, uh, quite new compared to uh, PostgreSQL uh, and also other database engines. Uh, this one is only uh, starting from 2018 and uh, 19. So it's only four or five years old, but it's very powerful. It's very easy to use. And so in the over the next couple of weeks, um, I think we cover this one four or five weeks, uh, three lectures per week. And so we are going to have at least 10 to 15 videos uh, teaching how to use DuckDB. And it's very easy to use. It's very powerful. We're going to cover this uh, starting tomorrow. So if you're interested in you are welcome to follow the tutorials in here. Every all the notebooks uh, will be made available. So all we need is just to uh, go to the video and then you can open this one, for example, using uh, Google Collab. And uh, let me see here. It doesn't have the link. You should have the Google Collab link here that you should be able to. I think if you check other ones and here, you can open this one using uh, Google Collab and then you can just try it out. The nice thing about this is um, just a simple um, binary or uh, install the python package then you can run through unlike other database engines that you have to install things on a computer and it's uh, taking a lot of space and it's not easily portable uh, this is everything is portable so it's just a simple file you can install easy and i'm so excited about this one so i'm looking forward to um, go through all the uh, key features of duckdb and also uh, doing geospatial so we can deal with a lot of uh, cloud native data for example geoparket and uh, other type of vector data and you can analyze the data very efficiently compared to other traditional um, databases okay so this is a brief video and like i said follow the website and also follow the youtube uh, all the links are in the video description below so you can click the link and you can check out the website three videos a week uh, over the next uh, four weeks so i'm looking forward to uh, seeing you and take care. See you. Bye bye.